We're here. We've been in Taiwan for over a month now and trying to catch up on some of the things that we're doing. We went and saw Qingsan Waterfall, which was a pretty local hike. There wasn't any other corners or any other tourists there. So we did make friends with some uh, locals. We tried some sea anemone at the bottom of the pond. And then this was a spot that no tourists ever go to, so people were really surprised to see us because we were with a local who was able to show us around. And there was this huge temple fully made out of seashells um, and coral, basically everything from the sea. to the first ever Din Tai Fung, which is super cool because we've been to Din Tai Fung in the States and it was really neat to see the first one created. It was originally just one floor and then uh, they slowly built up from there as it got more and more popular and has now has a Michelin star. After Taipei 101, we headed to Mao Kong Mountain where we rode a gondola all through the mountain into this little city town type thing. Um, really tucked away in the mountains. It was so beautiful. We went during sunset, which is the move, go during sunset and then hang out a little bit in the town and then on the ride back. It's all dark so you can see all the lights of Taipei. We took a private Tai Chi lesson. It was really fun. Uh, it's very underappreciated form of art. And Super difficult. Coordination is really hard. We learned how to walk. And even though you're moving really slowly, it feels like you're moving at a million miles an hour because of how much concentration it takes. So it's a really cool experience that we've always wanted to try out. Xinjiang Ding is kind of like the town square, town center. A lot of really cool shops, really cool stores, all the young people are there and it's just a really fun and populated area with lots and lots of things to do, lots of stores to see and night markets. Dongsan Temple is one of the oldest historical sites in Taipei City itself. It's really pretty, very crowded, lots of people will be there, so at least expect that, but it's worth a quick little visit and it's free. So next we went to Wai Ao, which is this little surfing town about two hours by train from Taipei. And this was like probably one of our favorite days we've had so far. And basically just went out surfing all day. Beautiful conditions, super warm water. Go to Wai Ao if you have a chance.